and welcome to English News Bulletin of Halabol. This is Rashmi here with you. Before moving to the details, let us have a look at the day's headlines. The Congress took a toll on the Modi-led central government while putting a light on the extreme hardships of the migrant laborers. On the occasion of Engineers Day, Chief Minister Biplab Kumar Dev attended Engineers Day program at Anik Club East Shripnagar, Agartala. Tripura Chief Minister Biplab Dev denied to have made any threatening comments against press and media. Now moving to the other details, the Congress took a toll on the Modi-led central government while putting a light on the extreme hardships of the migrant laborers said the ill-planned lockdown was a planned man-made crisis that broke down the backbone of India. Highlighting the insensitive inhuman behavior of the BGP government, the Congress put forward the problems and sufferings of the migrant laborers and workers, remembering the visuals from the 68th day of lockdown period when India witnessed one of the humanitarian crises. The Congress said the Indians could see the largest human migration in the country since independence. Daily wagers living in the cities after being reduced to beg for food, shelter and basic ration were forced to migrate back to their villages for dignity. The Congress alleged the apathetic Modi government didn't even help with the transport and they were forced to travel thousands of kilometers on foot along with their families. A man-made crisis because of the incompetent BJP government overlooked major population of the country while imposing an extreme lockdown with less than four hours notice period. The Labour Ministry was asked in Parliament if it had any data on the migrants who died while returning to their native places and whether the government provided any compensation to the victims' families. The Ministry stated that since no such data was maintained, there was no question of giving compensation to the victims next of kin. lockdown didn't even help to control the COVID cases but harmed the economy and human lives. Hundreds of migrant workers lost their lives during this exodus. Some came under a train, some died due to lack of water or food in the train, some died while walking in the scorching heat. The Congress condemned the BGP government claiming that the BGP government now tells the parliament that they have no data available on migrant workers who have lost their lives and no data on workers who lost their jobs. The BGP government went on to say that since there is no data, there is no question of giving compensation. The Congress said it's appealing how the Narendra Modi-led central government has raised its hand and decided to ignore their responsibility towards the people of India. The Congress further added that these migrant workers are the backbone of Indian economy who have built the country. They too deserve dignity and their lives too matter. Bureau report, Halabur. On the occasion of Engineers Day, Chief Minister Biplab Kumar Dev attended Engineers Day program at Anik Club East Shibnagar Agartala, expressed thanks to all the engineers for their hard work and efforts to convert Tripura into a smart city. Chief Minister Biplab Dev attended the program of celebration of 53rd Engineers Day at Oni Club, Shibnagar Agartala on Tuesday. Addressing the people present at the program, Chief Minister Biplab Dev remembered Bharat Ratna M. Vishweshwaraya on his birthday, which is celebrated as Engineers Day all over the world on 15th of September each year. He marked his extraordinary contribution to infrastructure building during pre- and post-independence India in the Deccan, Mysore, Pune, etc. His contribution to excellence in engineering. 
केडर मैनेजमेंट अपग्रेड हुआ सापेक्षे सरकार आंतरिक भावे अंतर्वर्ती कालीन समय इंजीनियर दे फुल ड्यूटी चार्ज एफडीसी पूर्तुब पालने पूर्वोत्तर सरकारे प्रदेशों तीन छोटा का थे के बढ़िए Adding to this, Chief Minister Biplav Dev claimed in the last 25 years, 13,221 houses were supplied water pipelines, whereas the BJP government provided connections to 8 lakh houses in two and a half years. He added, what the left-hand government failed to do in 25 years, the BJP made it up by supplying drinking water to more than 8 lakh families in the last two and a half years. He further assured that the BJP government would provide free drinking water to every household in the state by the end of December 2022. Also mentioned that this could be possible only due to the hard work of the engineers. Tripura Chief Minister Biplab Dev further claimed that the water logging problems of the city has been successfully solved in the state while converting Tripura into a smart city. In his speech at the Engineers Day program, Chief Minister Biplab Dev said, prior election, whenever he used to visit house to house in his own constituency, Bonomalipur, the people used to urge him to solve the water logging issues. He claimed that 90% of the problems in the Agartala city on water logging has been ended and the prime reason behind it is the new integrated center from where the experts come to know about the whole city's condition at the same time. He added the engineers have a major contribution in this. प्रत्येक बस रामादेव को होते होते निर्वाचन है जो कि नामी एक-एक घरे पोषता हूँ तो बनामाली बासी बनामेल कोर बासी रेक्टर ही हमारे सामने आवेदन थकतो जब अपना के हमरा प्रतिनिधि को रे पढ़ा गो किंतु आमादेव के ये ये वर्षा समय जोलेर का स्थिति है हमारे के हमादेव के प्लांटर जब प्रकृति प्रत्येक वर्ष चौथी होगा ताकि के मुक्त होगा बुधवार तारमुद्दे निश्चित इंजीनियर जैसे बड़ों भूमिका थके However, the reality of the city is totally different and water logging problems of the city is same as before. We will report Halabol. Tripura Chief Minister Biplav Dev denied to have made any threatening comments against press and media when a group of TV journalists went to meet him at the Secretariat on Tuesday said media has misinterpreted the comment. Comments made against the press and media by Chief Minister Biplap Kumar Deb has led to a thunderous situation in the media fraternity. Opposition political parties, Democratic Lawyers Association, Retrenched Teachers Association, Common People, Educated Youth has led joint protest against the anti-media utterance of Chief Minister Biplap Deb in a public meeting on 11th of September and following series of attacks on various journalists among the state. किचु किचु पत्र पत्रिका उत्ती उत्साही तो हुए तिपुरान मानुष के विभ्रांत हो कुर्चे इतिहास तादर माफ कर बे ना आमियो तादर माफ कर बोना इतिहास माफ कर बे ना तिपुरा वासी माफ कर बे ना आमी विप्लव देवे माफ कर बोना आमी जा बोली ताक कोरे जाए इतिहास शक्की इतिहास शक्की Tuesday, when representatives of electronic media went for a discussion at the Secretariat, Chief Minister Biplap Kumar Dev denied having issued any threat to the media while expressing his preparedness to accept constructive cooperation. He seeked cooperation from all the sections of media and appealed it not to confuse the people. He urged upon all to remain strong and steady and to extend cooperation to the government in coping with the raging COVID-19 situation. बुझाओ ची छेतरों मुलायम मारो ची छेतानी आमोचना करो ची जामरा के आमादे दायित्व छोटूक बाबे शवाई एक नागरे एक दिशाते पालन करते पार ची ना कोनो जगह कमी आचे तो शे जगह तो 
আত্মচিন্তন করা হচ্ছে যদি আমার সরকারের দ্বারাও কোনো কিছু এমন ভুল ত্রুটি হয় সরকারেরও আত্মচিন্তন করা উচিত আমরা করি করি বলেই পরিবর্তন হয় এক রোহাতে এই সরকার কাজ করে না আমরা পরিবর্তনে বিশ্বাসী যখনই দেখি পাবলিক কি চাইছে তার উপর আমরা নিয়মকানুন চেঞ্জ করে দিই আমি কি চাইছি সেটা হলো কেন পাবলিক কি চাইছে সেটা যদি গভর্নমেন্ট ইমপ্লিমেন্ট করতে পারে সেটা হচ্ছে বাইদার হয়ে পড়ছে তো আমার কোনো মতেই সেই যে বিষয় যেটা আমি সাবলম্বে রেখেছি তো তার মধ্যে কাউকে দুঃখ করার জন্য কাউকে মানে তিরস্কার করার জন্য আমি বলিনি ত্রিপুরার মানুষ যাতে বিভ্রান্ত না হয় তার জন্য আমি প্রতিজ্ঞাবদ্ধ ও তাদেরকে সাহসের সঙ্গে রাখা এবং সমস্ত ত্রিপুরাবাসীকে সুস্থ রাখা ও বিভিন্ন যে ষড়যন্ত্র বিভিন্ন জায়গায় আমি দেখি সবসময় সেগুলোতে পা না দেওয়া আমি না বললে কি বলবো রাজ্যের প্রধান ব্যক্তি না বললে তো মানুষ বলবে যে না ঠিকই আছে এমনই হতবা চলছে এমনই হতবা চলছে However, while denying to have made any threatening comment against the media, Chief Minister Biplab Kumar Dev failed to make any unconditional apology, said that the media has misinterpreted that statement. On the other side, the journalist assembly had given three days time to Chief Minister to make an apology for his threatening remark against press and media. Bureau Report, Halabol. BJP member raised serious allegations of illegal trafficking by a minister, asked for help as a group of miscreants led by the concerned minister of Kamalpur under Dhalai district threatened to kill him. One Amul Gope, son of Birendra Chandra Gope, resident of Noyagao under Kamalpur police station at Dhalai district, raised stern allegations against the illegal activities carried out by ruling parties members. He said from the past 18 months, the condition of Kamalpur 45 number word is terrible. He tried to evade the concerned authorities several times, but no one paid any heed to it. Lastly, he wrote a letter to the chief minister and voiced his allegations. Amul alleged as he tried to stop the illegal activities and informed the same to the senior party leaders, the concerned BJP minister has put an end to his only son's studies. On the orders of that minister, his business has been ruined. He further added in the name of giving work to the poor people of Bangladesh, the minister has been doing a business of lakhs of rupees. Amul further alleged that on the orders of the ruling party minister, his drinking water supply has also been stopped. Stopped. He urged Chief Minister to make a way for him to stay for seven days at Agatala as the minister and his group allegedly threatened to kill him. বাধা সৃষ্টি করার সময় অসংখ্য রড় দিয়ে বাইরে বাইরে আমাদের কর্মকর্তারা পঞ্চায়েতের প্রতিনিধিরা একজন খ্রিস্টমুখ মারা বন্ধ করেছে কতদিন ধরে এর আজকে প্রায় দুই বছর হতে লাগলো এই ব্যবসা বাণিজ্য চালিয়ে যাচ্ছে মানে বিজেপি গভর্নমেন্ট আসার পর থেকে এই ব্যবসা চলছে এরা সাত পাঁচ মাস পরে থেকে এরা আসল রূপ ধারণ করছে এরা কয়েকজনে এই শিবব্রত মজুমদার নাম্বার ওয়ান ক্রিমিনাল Amal Gopi said as he opposed the criminal and illegal activities, he and his family has undergone brutal attacks and are devoid of any kind of government services and help. He further added this type of persons inside the ruling party are defaming the party and breaking its ideologies. Bureau Report, Halabol. Well, that's all from the English desk at this moment. For more news and updates, stay tuned to Halabol.